The way they act at feed time, you'd think we don't feed them, but it's obvious we do. Yeah. Nancy's like, oh, grain. <laughs> Over there. There's Margo and Dapple watching them babies. Hey guys, uh, we had our first baby goats early this morning and uh, our nanny's still trying to pass her stuff. I have to keep an eye on that, but uh, actually she had triplets again. She had triplets last year and uh, triplets again and unfortunately one of them didn't make it. Uh, not sure why or what happened exactly, but uh, we try to keep a real close eye on them, but <coughs> unfortunately it didn't make it and it was pretty small, but uh, the other two seemed to be doing good. And uh, they were all girls, so that's a, that's a good thing. And uh, we weighed them all ago. I think one was seven and a half and one was eight, so. About average size babies, but like I say, the one we lost, it was, it was pretty small. And unfortunately, that's just part of it uh, on a farm. You, uh, you have life and you have let death, but uh, you try, try to prevent it all you can, but it just uh, happens sometimes. So we've been pretty fortunate with our, with our goats and stuff and, uh, so anyway, but uh, we want to give you guys an update. We went ahead and uh, I wormed her earlier. And uh, we always worm them right after they kid. Some, they get really wormy easy if you, uh, after they kid, I guess the stress and everything. But I don't know if she can pan over there and show you. Those little ones are I don't know if was asleep standing up or what. But like I said, our nanny, she still uh, hadn't passed all of her stuff, so we may have to uh, doctor on her and kind of help her along with that. What is it? We'll watch her. But, uh, anyway, guys, uh, they got a nice little heater there. They were in it earlier, but I've been in there and I milked her a little bit, and uh, as you, you're going to see, and uh, we'll put that up and save it in case we need it later. But right now, mama and babies are good, and, and uh, more to come. We still got... Uh, we got two more probably this weekend. One, I think, is actually due Sunday. And one is due Monday, I believe. But one's due on the first and one's due on the thirty. The thirty first and the first, I believe it is. So uh, and then we'll have a little break till February. And around February twentieth, somewhere in there, I'll have to look on the calendar. We got I think four are due all at the same time and uh, they are first time mamas, or we got, we got four first time mamas, so let's watch them like a hawk. And, uh, hope that they're good mamas. We might have to help them a little bit, but their mamas are good mamas, so maybe they'll be good mamas. And, uh, they seem to be making little bags and everything. Like I said, they still got about, about a month, a little less than a month. And, uh, and then we got one more if she's bred. She's big anyway, but if she's bred, it'll be uh, about the first, second week of March, I believe. But 
Anyway, giving you guys an update where we got our first ones for uh, 2021. So, fingers crossed, everything else goes on good. Thanks. Be in a minute, Hazy. When, when we did outside. 